Here's another one from April 24th, which is the same thing. You know, it's being marked as made for kids, and it's also from the U.S. Department of State. Shout out to at 2017fan1 for DMing me these on Twitter. And yeah, I thought this was another case of a whole channel being marked as made for kids. But this is another live stream from the same channel, and it's not marked as made for kids. So it seems like these two specific videos about COVID-19 have been marked as made for kids, and I don't really have any idea why. Obviously, this isn't content that is specifically targeted towards children. So it's just another mislabeling case, but as you guys know, I like to try to point out unique cases. This is a pretty unique case because this is a government official video that has been marked as made for kids, mislabeled as made for kids, I should say, from the official U.S. Department of State YouTube channel. So I would assume that they have enough power to tell YouTube, hey, look, our video is being marked as made for kids, and it shouldn't be. A few of you have been speculating why videos get marked as made for kids and why they don't. But if they don't follow these various factors, then they shouldn't be marked as made for kids. You know, like subject matter of the video, like, and their example is educational content for preschoolers. Obviously not the case with a video like this. Child actors or models in the video, there were none. Are children the intended audience of the video? I don't think that this press conference for the coronavirus is targeting children. So on and so forth. You can read the rest of the list 